This morning, nine-year-old Charlotte Senna is back with her family after vanishing from a weekend camping trip in upstate New York. We're overcome with relief and gratitude for this gift to all of us. Authorities managed to track down and arrest 47-year-old Craig Nelson Ross Jr. after they recovered a ransom note that had been dropped off at Charlotte's family home early Monday morning. He literally drove up to the family's mailbox assuming they were not home, leaving a critical piece of evidence behind his own fingerprint. Police entering that fingerprint into their database, discovering a match for a DWI in 1999 in the city of Saratoga. According to police, investigators searched multiple residences before closing in. They found a double wide house with a woman, the suspect's mother. The suspect lived in the camper behind. They have what they call a dynamic entry. Around 6.32 p.m., police had the suspect in custody and immediately located Charlotte in the camper, physically unharmed, inside a cupboard. She knew she was being rescued. She knew that she was in safe hands. What were some of the biggest takeaways from this search? Things can happen in, in an instant. You know, Charlotte was no more than probably two-tenths of a mile from where she was camping. The massive search for Charlotte lasting two days involving more than 400 personnel. Charlotte's family reported her missing Saturday evening when she never returned to their campsite from a bike ride. We got a miracle. The news of Charlotte's safe homecoming turned a planned vigil Monday night into prayers answered. If you can say something to Charlotte right now, what would you oh, say? Oh, honey, welcome home.